As Antiques Road Trip fans will know, occasionally the auction room pulls out a huge surprise for viewers with unforgettable profits. Today's episode saw Anita Manning and Raj Bizaram take in the delights of Suffolk, Kent and Surrey before heading back to Essex for their third auction. Voicing the show, Tim Wanagut said, Now, it all comes down to Raj's final lot. Risking a huge sum on money, Tim added, it's his gamble buy. Will it pay off? BBC Antiques Road Trip, most memorable moments well, that's all over. I need a cup of tea and eat a manning as the glassware was paraded at the auction. The auctioneer then explained that the item had received a lot of interest. He said, quite a bit of interest in this ladies and gentlemen. I must start the bidding here with me. At £100 then. Let's advance on £100. Wishing her rival luck. Anita smiled, good luck darling. BBC This Fabergé flower brooch has reportedly been valued at up to £1 million learning that bidding for the £165 glass dish would start at just £100. Anita sighed, that's not a lot. The auctioneer then rumbled on, it all on the internet at the moment. £160 now. £170. There's a commission bid against you. £180. £190 now, still with me. £200. £220 is bid. £230 now. Shocked at just how far the profit rose. Anita gasped as Raj looked on in disbelief. The auctioneer continued, £240. £250. £260 now is bid. £260 is the bid then. Last opportunity now. I'm about to sell at £260 then. BBC Antiques Roadshow surprised a woman by revealing her dirty painting. Of a nude pregnant female was worth about £3,000 to £5,000 selling for £260. Anita gasped, ah. That was wonderful. I'm glad you got that, as Raj chirped, £260? Tim then voiced, an amazing profit for Raj. Anita continued, well, that's all over. I need a cup of tea, as Raj added, what an auction. What an auction. The episode also saw Anita rest from shopping to visit a former silk mill with an incredible royal connection. Meanwhile, Raj heard about the birth of interior design and the pioneering artist behind it, William Morris.